what's poppin'? It's your boy from the C, the ATL Don, checking in. This week, we got another sneaker pickup. Without further ado, let's get into this. Make sure you go follow us over on Instagram at Infamous C Music. Links in the description. Also over here in the corner of the screen. If you'd like to know more about these, also follow us on the other social media platforms, Twitter and Facebook. All right, uh, before we get into this, this is for educational and review purposes only. I do repeat, this is for educational and review purposes only. You already know what it is from the title and the thumbnail. Of course, Jordan 1, my favorite Jordan silhouette of all time. So this week we got the Jordan 1 Bread. This is the 2016 release, a.k.a. Band. I've had this shoe a few times. This is the third time I've had this particular version of it. All right. So we'll start off with the right foot. So... Uh, Looks really, really good. It's got nice shape to it. The toe box is looking good. Let me show you some close-ups. So that's why I like the toe box to look with that. How it narrows down like that. Sometimes you see they're a little bit too boxy. Got the tumble leather effect on the red leather. It looks to be a little bit more dominant on the swooshes and the toe box than on the upper and on the heel. Hourglass shape's looking good. Nike Air's looking good on the tongue. Yeah, that was a little bit tough getting that out. So, got the white insoles, red Nike Air. If anybody wants to see the side of there. Very nice. Just recently got rid of my newest pair of these I had. Had a guy hit me up and bought probably close to 10 pairs from me. Wiped out all my Travis Scott's that I had in the collection. Got these and the Shadow Backboards and several others from me. So it does come with extra white and red laces. I prefer black. Red looks okay. Never been a fan personally of um, the white when it comes to the breads, just my personal opinion. Let's just make sure the leather's consistent on this one. Everything looks on point. The red bottoms. Let me pull out my, I have a used pair of the 2016, we'll use to compare the, uh, see how well the red looks to compare to it. The red on my used pair looks a little darker, not bad though. The leather may feel a little softer on my used pair, but they also been worn, so that could be a re reason behind that as well. I 
and on my used pair the red seems to have more of a tumbled look in this area compared to these Wing logo looks good. Let's see how the printing on the inside where it says the size and everything. And see how that looks on this one. Try to get them both in the same frame. Everything looks on point. That's really the only differences I see is the uh, the red just a hair dark. Uh, it's a hair darker on the used pair that I have, and the leather seems more tumbled on this upper part on the used pair versus this pair. But that can happen on it on anything you get retail. You know, quality control is not going to be the same everywhere because they make these in multiple factories so very nice happy to add them to the collection stay tuned to the end of the video for close-ups once again don't forget to go follow over on instagram at infamous c music link in the description also on the screen comment down below let me know what you think of these happy to have an, another pair in the collection Please give a big thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. Trends are limited merch in the description. Until next time, it's your boy from the C, the ATL Don, signing out. Peace. Let's go to